for more information related to the civil engineering concepts and civil engineering updates please visit my website civilbasics123.com go to type civilbasics123.com in google so that my website will be open here like this so which is consisting of all detailed concepts related to the civil engineering topics so please follow my website civilbasics123.com in this video lecture i will explain you complete detailing about the isolated footing design and combined footing design by using stat pro v8 software for the g plus 2 structural model so initially i will explain you the complete concept regarding the isolated footing design then after that i will explain you complete details about the combined footing design so basically combined footing will be provided for the building structure if the building center to center distance between the column is less than the standard value that is 3 meters section okay so firstly i will show you the model which is related to the g plus 2 building model so i was already done my analysis process and designing process by using stat pro software so go to click on the stat pro v8 software here okay so this is the building model which is consisting of approximately of 14 meter length again it will be consisting of approximately of 8 meter width again it will be consisting of approximately of 12 meter width okay so for this building structure i was taking the dimensions of the column is approximately 0.46 cross 0.23 and the beam is approximately 0.35 cross 0.23 and slab is approximately equal to 125 mm okay so again i was taking the load cases which is comes under the gravitational loading condition system only okay so why because this respected building is not exceeding 10 meter that's why i was eliminated this respected wind loading condition and i was assumed that this building was located in zone 2 condition so that's why i was not considered the seismic loading condition okay so here i was taken self weight beam load and floor load condition system in this also live load also i was taken floor load condition system for the building structure okay so this is the load combinations under this respected section so for this building it was consisting of approximately the beam uh, reinforcement here like this which is consisting of 4 bars of 10 mm diameter at the top and it will be consisting of 2 bars of uh, uh, 12 mm diameter at the bottom okay so again for the column section it will be consisting of 12 number of the sorry 8 numbers of the bars which is consisting of 12 mm diameter okay so after designing process is completed we need to proceed with the foundation design okay so go to click on the foundation design so select your respected two types of the load cases which is related to the dead loading condition live loading condition click on the run stand foundation option okay so that the fixed supports which is there for the g plus 2 building structural model will be directly imported to stat foundation software in the start foundation software you can easily design the isolated footing and combined footing okay so firstly i am proceeding with the isolated footing design so for that firstly we have to uh, create the load combination for the uh, node points okay select the loads and factors here so generate load combinations option select the code provision is indian standard system so click on generate load combination for the uh, service load combination again we have to click on the load combination for the ultimate load combination okay so after that we have to create the job setup as per the consideration select the create new job option select the job type just i am taking here as isolated footing so here i am taking isolated footing as per the code provision is indian standard system and units will be in si all supports and we have to add the load combination as per the created dead low live load condition systems here okay so click on create job option so that the isolated footing job will be created on the left hand side here like this so which is consisting of the cover and soil type so concrete and rebar section footing geometry sliding and overturning so you can click on the directly design okay so before that if you want to enter the values of the soil bearing capacity you can directly click on the cover and soil type here and you can edit this respected value so as per my consideration just i am taking here as 200 so click on the design option directly click on s option so that the isolated footing will be designed as per the is codal provision 2000 code here okay so these are the calculation part which is comes under the isolated footing so for example just i am taking isolated footing 35 here which is consisting of all individual calculations for this respected foundation as per considerations of the building standards okay so click on the starting page this is the geometry this is the details and drawing so which is consisting of all detailed concepts regarding the details for the respected foundation okay which is consisting of approximately of 50 mm cover at the bottom it will be consisting of approximately of 6 mm diameter bar with a 70 center to center distance for the top reinforcement section again it will be consisting of bottom section is also of 6 mm diameter with the 70 mm center to center distance for the mesh okay so this is the elevation view for this respected foundation okay so this is the top view for this respected foundation which is consisting of approximately 1.35 cross 1.35 okay so the mesh will be consisting of approximately 6 mm diameter at 
60 center to center distance okay so click on the ga drawing this is the ga drawing for the foundation click on the calculation sheet this is the graph okay so this is the complete design under uh, your respected section of isolated footing okay now i will explain you how to design the combined footing okay so for that firstly we have to click on the foundation design again again i am selecting two types of the load cases that is related to the dead load live load click on include option click on run start foundation again the fixer support for this respected building is directly imported to another foundation okay so now you can see it was open with the new window which is related to the foundation design so now initially we need to uh, create the load combination which is similar to that of isolated footing select the loads and factors here click on generate loads select here as indian standard system click on generate load combination okay so click on okay so click on generate load combination for the uh, ultimate load combination okay so after that again we have to uh, create the job setup so click on the create new job option so firstly we have to select this respected job name just i am taking here as combined footing c o m select the job type is approximately of combined one okay so select the design code is indian standard system and units will be of si system and select the load combinations here just i am selecting here 1 2 3 4 5 6 here click on include option so after the including is completed we need to create the strips for this respected foundation okay so for that we need to uh, click on the create job option so that it will create the isolated footing job information here like this so before that we need to create the before analysis process we need to create the strips here so for that firstly we have to select this respected first foundation so here i am selecting this again i am selecting here okay click on create from selected nodes so that it will create the one strip for this respected section again in the same process just i am selecting here second one again i am selecting third one click on the create option so that it will create the one more strip here like this in the same process we have to create the all the strips for the remaining sections here like this So now you can see here I was created all the strips here like this. Select the combined footing section, design parameters. So concrete and rebar values here. So this is the cover and soil type. So here also I am taking the uh, soil bearing capacity is 200. So footing geometry here. Click on design option. Click on this option. Okay. So that it will design the isolated footing design as per the IS456 code provisions. Okay. So it is doing the isolated footing design. So now we can see it will show you the all the calculation part which is involved in this respected isolated footing. Just I am selecting the isolated footing which is related to the uh, 26 number. So it will be consisting of each and individual calculation part which is related to the isolated footing here like this. Okay. So click on the starting page geometry. So this is the details and drawing for this respected isolated footing. So it will be consisting of approximately of reinforcement values here like this. So which is consisting of a, a 12 mm diameter bars. Okay. At the top section with 180 center to center distance for the strips. Again it will be consisting of clear cover of 50 mm. Again, it will be consisting of approximately 12 mm diameter. Okay. So throughout this respected section, it will be consisting of approximately 5 meter length section. Okay. So if you design the isolated, uh, if you design the foundation with the help of the uh, isolated footing, so it will give the reinforcement details here like this, which is consisting of approximately uh, the reinforcement strip of 6 mm diameter bar with 70 center to center distance for the individual columns. If you design a foundation for this respected G plus 2 building with the combined strip footing, so it will give the reinforcement details here like this which is consisting of approximately of 12 mm diameter bar with 180 mm center to center distance okay so here now you can see the diameter of the bar is increases and the center to center distance between the bar is increasing for the respected foundation so in the isolated footing it is comes under around the value is 66 here it is 180 okay so it will be uh, three times of your respected isolated footing center to center distance between the each bar for the footing section okay so this is the complete process of designing of isolated footing and combined footing for the G plus to building structure by using StatPro V8A software. So if you have any queries about this respected video, please try to text me your questions in the below comment box. I will try to give the answer for this respected question. Thank you.